Chapter 1191, Performance On the cliff, Lin Dong introduced first Elder Zhu Li and the rest. As for Little Martin and Little Flame, Ying Sunzi and the rest already knew of them and their relationship with Lin Dong. First Elder Zhu Li and the rest were rather courteous towards Ying Sunzi. Although it was mostly because of their relationship with Lin Dong, Ying Sunzi was also rather powerful, making him a worthy individual in their eyes. Sect Master, tell us about Yuan Gate. We have recently returned from Demon Region and do not clearly understand Yuan Gate's situation. When he mentioned Yuan Gate, a chilling light surged in Lin Dong's black pupils. Yuan Gate started the war a year ago, however, they only attacked other super sects back then, and even found some justification. Although the other super sects were somewhat unhappy with Yuan Gate's domineering actions, they did not wish to offend Yuan Gate because of matters that were not their own. Ying Sunzi laughed bitterly and continued, Who would have guessed that the increasingly savage Yuan Gate will directly declare war against all of the super sects a short while after? Moreover, the most astonishing thing was that Yuan Gate's power had soared to a rather terrifying level. Their Samsara stage super experts had rapidly rose in number. The other super sects were completely incapable of resisting. In the end, they were gradually defeated one by one. Now, besides those who have surrendered and allied themselves with Yuan Gate, only Ardeo sect and Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace remain amongst the Eastern Qian region's super sections. Half a year ago, Yuan Gate dispatched a huge number of troops to attack Dao sect. Amongst them, there was a total of five Samsara stage experts. It was fortunate that Huan Huan managed to stop three of them. Although we stopped them in the end, Huawen was also injured. Ying Sunzi said. There should be one known as Zhao Kui amongst the three right? He has already been killed by me. Lin Dong faintly smiled and said. If I encounter those three again, they will not be my match. Ying Huan Huan glanced at Lin Dong as her red lips raised slightly. Although she had said such words, the cold aura from her body seemed to weaken a little at this moment. However, some of these Yuan Gate Samsara stage experts do not have stable auras. They do not seem to have steadily grown to this level, but were instead artificially strengthened by someone. Lin Dong chuckled. Soon after, he remarked in a low voice. Yes. Ying Sunzi nodded. Moments later, he bitterly smiled and said, however this is already very frightening. In the past, the power of the samsara stage was enough for one to become to leader of a section. They have likely borrowed the power of the Yumo. Lin Dong slowly said. Yumo. Upon hearing this, Ying Sunzi's expression changed slightly. At his level, he naturally knew of some information related to the Yumo and understood how terrifying they were. Ying Huan Huan's shapely eyebrows faintly wrinkled. A strange light flitted across her ice blue pupils. When I was in the chaotic demon sea, I met the previous generation of three little kings. I discovered the existence of the devil seed within their bodies. Moreover, the people who were dispatched by Yuan Gate to kill me later on all had the power of the Yumo. Lin Dong softly said. This Yuan Gate is truly too much, they still dare to dispatch men to kill you after chasing you away. Ying Sunzi was furious upon hearing this. Although Lin Dong had made it seem as if it was no big deal, everyone knew that it would have definitely been a terrible battle. Hee <laughs> hee, it is no issue. Everyone they sent died in the end after all. Lin Dong shook his head. After pondering for some time, he continued. What about those three old dogs? How powerful are they now? Ying Sunzi was stunned. Soon after, he secretly chuckled. Turns out that Lin Dong was referring to the Yuan Gate's three titans, ever since the war started, the Tian Yuanzi trio have practically never showed their faces. Never showed their faces. It was now Lin Dong's turn to be stunned. Yes. Ying Sunzi nodded his head with a grave expression. Clearly shown terror was not the thing that made one worry, it was the unknown that truly caused one to feel fear. The situation in the eastern Qian region had already developed to such a state, yet the three Yuan Gate sect masters were completely silent. 
This instead caused one to feel uneasy. In addition, according to some information that we obtained, Yuan Gate seems to be up to something big recently. My senses tell me that they are targeting our Dao sect. After all, Yuan Gate hates our Dao sect to the core, yet we've been able to survive all this time. This time, they will surely have a method to annihilate our Dao sect. Ying Suanzi slowly said. However, Lin Dong's return should not be known by time for the time being. Given our Dao sect's current strength, we are not afraid of them. Ying Xiao Xiao interjected. With the support of Lin Dong's huge force, Dao sect no longer needed to be constantly on the edge like before. Something big hui. Lin Dong coldly chuckled, since that is so, we'll have to properly receive them. Ying Suanzi nodded his head. The current Lin Dong was clearly no longer the little Dao sect disciple from three years ago. His boldness and strength had already surpassed a sect master like Ying Suanzi. With Lin Dong around, even Ying Suanzi felt a little more confident. Good. As long as Yuan Gate dares to come again, our Dao sect will definitely settle all of our debts. After chatting with Lin Dong for a while, Ying Suanzi and the rest started to leave. Little Martin, First Elder Zhu Li and the rest also followed suit. No one knew if it was intentional, but they left Lin Dong and Ying Huawen alone, and no one would bother them for some time. As the crowd dispersed, the atmosphere between the two became much more silent. Lin Dong gazed at the slender and soft body of the girl beside him, and once again looked at her long ice blue hair. A faint chilling aura enveloped her body, causing him to softly sigh, you've used too much of the power that does not belong to you. Within his voice was a little reproach. However the regret within was even greater. Upon hearing his words, Ying Huan Huan glared at him. Soon after, she gritted her pearly white teeth as she replied, what else could I do? Since you were no longer around, I needed to protect Dao sect, moreover. If I could only powerlessly watch you almost die like three years ago, I would rather become an emotionless ice mountain. Towards the end, even her voice had become much softer. A faint crimson red flush seemed to flash across her cold face. Then I will better protect you in future, so please utilize that power less. Lin Dong's heart warmed a little as he smiled. Ying Huan Huan's beautiful eyes stared at Lin Dong. Her crescent moon-shaped eyebrows seemed to arch in joy, but she turned her head away as she spoke, I will not believe someone who knocked me unconscious at the important juncture. This last still held a grudge. Lin Dong helplessly smiled. Can your hair turn back? Lin Dong asked as he looked at Ying Huan Huan's long ice blue hair and sighed in his heart. Why? You think it doesn't look good? Ying Huan Huan suddenly turned her head and glared at Lin Dong. Lin Dong dryly laughed as he rapidly shook his head. He knew that Ying Huan Huan should be aware of certain things, but it was because of such awareness that she was so sensitive. Ying Huan Huan slightly lowered her head. Moments later, she lifted it up again as she softly said to Lin Dong, It's been a long time since you've returned to Dao sect. I'll take you on a stroll. She had already walked forward while she spoke. Lin Dong's eyes had a rather complicated expression as he slowly followed. The two wandered within Dao sect. Pills rivers hung in the sky, while rumbling noises echoed into the distance. Huge groups of Dao sect disciples would walk past from time to time, however, those ambiguous gazes would pause on the duo, while giggles could be heard from far away. Lin Dong felt a little helpless due to these gazes but Ying Huan Huan who was walking half a step ahead rather enjoyed them. So much so that a faint smile hung on her usually frosty face. It was an extremely moving sight. However, a smile also surfaced on Lin Dong's face as he watched that lovely figure. Her long ice blue hair shimmered under the sunlight. Such a feeling was not bad at all. Do you know what that is? At the front, Ying Huan Huan's footsteps suddenly stopped. She tilted her head back slightly, as her slender jade-like finger pointed to the front. Her beautiful face had become extremely gentle. Lin Dong lifted his head, only to see a horizontal pill river. 
the towering giant tree within the Pill River covered a radius of no less than a thousand feet. Astonishing energy undulations spread out from the giant tree, while numerous fist-sized fruits hung from it. These fruits were ripe with abundant energy. This is, the immortal Yuan ancient tree. Lin Dong gazed at this ancient tree in amazement. Soon after, he joyfully asked. Yes. Ying Huan Huan smiled, spellbound as she looked upon the ancient tree. In that moment, the cold aura around her body had completely vanished. She was just like the charming and lively girl from back then. Lin Dong's eyes also held complicated feelings and nostalgia. To obtain this immortal Yuan ancient tree seed back then, the young girl had remained behind to stop their formidable enemies. However, he had hastily rushed back to save her. In a way, this immortal Yuan ancient tree was something they had worked together to protect. The two wore gentle expressions as they stood under the immortal Yuan ancient tree in silence. Unknowingly, the sun began to set. Lin Dong gradually recovered from his daze. He gently patted Ying Huan Huan's shoulders as he smiled and said, How long do you plan on standing here? When she saw that this blockhead had broken the mood, Ying Huan Huan could not help but roll her eyes at him. Such a mannerism was a little flirtatious. Let's go to the desolate hall. Lin Dong stretched his waist as he continued, It's already been so long, I have to fulfill my promise after all. Promise. Ying Huan Huan was taken aback. Soon after, she was rather amused as she said, You mean the great desolate tablet? Fancy you remembering. Your two-year promise has long since passed, if it was not for me, the great desolate tablet would have long died due to being swindled by you. Lin Dong felt somewhat awkward. It was indeed his fault, and it was fortunate that Ying Huan Huan was here to help, or else. The Great Desolate Tablet said that the power of two ancestral symbols are needed to deal with the Yumo King sealed under it. I should be able to settle things now. Lin Dong said. Ancestral Symbol Hui. I also have one. Ying Huan Huan softly said. She extended a slender snow white hand as snowflakes gathered at the center of her palm. An ancient symbol suffused with ice patterns slowly appeared within it. This is... Lin Dong gazed at the ancient symbol in Ying Huan Huan's hand as his pupils involuntarily tightened a little. The ice ancestral symbol. Let's go and deal with that troublesome thing. Ying Huan Huan flipped her jade-like hand as the ice ancestral symbol faded. Without looking at Lin Dong, she turned and left. Wait. Lin Dong suddenly spoke up. Ying Huan Huan tilted her head back and looked at him with her beautiful eyes. You. Lin Dong gazed into her ice blue eyes, but his hands could not help but slowly clench into fists. You, will always be Ying Huan Huan, right? Ying Huan Huan did not reply. She deeply looked at Lin Dong. A long while later, the corners of her mouth curled as she lightly skipped forward with her hands behind her back. Soon after, her lovely voice was heard. That will depend on your performance. Chapter 1192, Entering the Tablet The Deepest Part of the Desolate Hall Two rays of light flashed across the sky, before they showed themselves. They were Lin Dong and Ying Huan Huan. When Lin Dong saw this familiar mountain range, many flashbacks from three years ago surfaced in his mind. Soon after, he smiled at Ying Huan Huan and asked, Do you still remember the bet we made back then? Ying Huan Huan used her hand to straighten a loose hair near her ear. Promptly, she pursed her red lips before she replied with a smile, Why are you such a calculative person? Moreover, it's your fault for having such poor judgment. You could have entered the Sky Hall, yet you chose the Desolate Hall instead. You truly don't know how to appreciate kindness. Lin Dong smiled. Now that he thought about it, he really missed what happened back then. Soon after the Lin Dong duo appeared, many light figures rushed over from the distance. Following which, Ying Suanzi, Little Martin and the rest hurried over. What are you guys planning to do? Ying Suanzi looked at the two of them before glancing at the ground. From his expression, 
it was clear that he knew what was going on with the great desolate tablet. I am the one who told father. Beside him, Ying Huan Huan said in a soft voice. It is not easy to deal with the Yumo that is being suppressed by the great desolate tablet. Moreover, Dao sect will definitely be the first to suffer if it escapes. Lin Dong nodded. This matter was extremely important to Dao sect. As the sect master, it was only right for Ying Suanzi to be informed. Sect master, all of you should set up a formation outside. Kill anything that manages to escape from within. Lin Dong said in a deep voice. According to what Yan said, the creature being suppressed by the great desolate tablet was a true king who had passed two reincarnation tribulations. Therefore, if that being managed to escape, it would definitely cause them a great deal of problems. Little Martin, First Elder Zhu Li, please assist them. Nothing must go awry. Lin Dong looked at Little Martin's group and said with a grave expression. Additionally, Marshal Uncle Wu Dao, please temporarily evacuate the disciples of the desolate hall and move them to the other halls. Ying Huan Huan looked at Wu Dao, who had hurried over, before she said. Understood. After seeing this lineup, Wu Dao immediately understood the severity of this matter. He quickly acknowledged Ying Huan Huan's orders before withdrawing. After which, he began to evacuate the disciples of the desolate hall. Lin Dong nodded upon seeing this. Then, with a grave expression, he looked at the land below. After which, he stomped his foot before a majestic force directly penetrated the empty space and entered the land. Rumble. The entire mountain range shook violently after that force charged into the ground. After which, a huge crack slowly spread across the land. Finally, a huge and ancient stone tablet slowly rose from within the crack. Buzz. Dark chilly winds suddenly blew across the sky after that ancient stone tablet appeared. Meanwhile, there seemed to be screeches being vaguely emitted. This unusual phenomenon caused Lin Dong's heart to sink. It seems like the great desolate tablet was quite badly eroded by the demonic aura over the last three years. The ancient stone tablet finally broke free from the ground and completely revealed itself in front of everyone's eyes. When Lin Dong looked at it, he involuntarily clenched his fists. Currently, that huge tablet was covered with countless black demonic lines. These demonic lines were scattered across the tablet and they resembled the meridians of a person. Meanwhile, a death-like aura was being slowly emitted from the stone tablet. Other than those demonic lines, which pulsed like a heart, the stone tablet was also covered by a thick layer of ice. Currently, blue light was glimmering on that layer of ice, suppressing some of the demonic aura. As of now, I am only able to suppress some of the demonic aura and slow down the erosion. Ying Huan Huan softly said. This layer of ice was clearly her handiwork. However, it was obvious that the true king within the great desolate tablet was extremely powerful. Hence, she was unable to destroy it with her current strength. This is more than enough. Lin Dong said solemnly. If it was not because Ying Huan Huan had intervened and helped to suppress the demonic aura, it was likely that the great desolate tablet would not be able to hang on until his return. What should we do now? Ying Huan Huan asked. I will enter the great desolate tablet and finish off that true king. Lin Dong said. Only by killing that true king, would the demonic aura disappear. Following which, the great desolate tablet would be able to recover. I will go with you. Ying Huan Huan said without any hesitation. The Yumo king within the great desolate tablet was extremely powerful. Therefore, she was worried and did not want Lin Dong to go by himself. Lin Dong hesitated for a moment upon hearing this. Humph. I am not weaker than you and I will not be a burden. After she saw his hesitation, Ying Huan Huan immediately snorted softly and said. Lin Dong smiled bitterly. He pondered for a moment before he nodded. As of now, Ying Huan Huan was indeed completely different compared to before. In fact, in an actual fight, he might not be able to defeat her. Furthermore, this was going to be an extremely dangerous task. Hence, 
he knew that he would have a better chance of success with her by his side. All right. This time around, we will join forces to eliminate that devil. Ying Huan Huan nodded with satisfaction after she saw Lin Dong nodding his head. Everyone, I will leave everything on the outside to you guys. Lin Dong once again reminded Little Martin's group. After which, he extended his hand towards Ying Huan Huan. The latter's face reddened slightly upon seeing this. After which, she placed her delicate hand into his. An icy chill spread after her little hand landed into Lin Dong's palm. It felt like ice, which had been frozen for tens of thousands of years, and that chill drilled deep into his bones. Ugh! Lin Dong sighed softly in his heart, before pity flashed across his eyes. After which, he gradually tightened his grip over Ying Huan Huan's small hand. It was as though he wanted to warm that small icy cold hand. Let's get going. Ying Huan Huan became a little absent-minded after she detected Lin Dong's action. Promptly, she tilted her head. Her eyes were a little red as she softly urged him. Lin Dong smiled. His body moved before the both of them transformed into a ray of light and rushed into the Great Desolate Tablet. Ripples appeared on the surface of the Great Desolate Tablet just as they came into contact with it. After which, the both of them vanished. Darkness came surging over like floodwaters after they entered the Great Desolate Tablet. Lin Dong quickly but gently grabbed that icy cold palm. Buzz! An icy blue light suddenly erupted and expelled the darkness. Lin Dong turned his head and saw that Ying Huan Huan had lifted her other hand. Meanwhile, there was an ice lamp being formed on her fingertips. Gentle yet icy cold light, was being emitted from that ice lamp. Ying Huan Huan looked at the darkness. Then, a cold glint flashed across her pretty eyes before she spoke in a faint voice, Aren't you looking down on us by using such petty tricks? A huge ice lotus surfaced under their feet after her voice sounded. Soon after, that ice lotus rotated, before countless flower petals shot into the darkness. Many sharp screeches followed. Those flower petals shattered transforming into glowing spots that scattered. Lin Dong surveyed his surroundings, before he saw countless huge black snakes crouching within the darkness. Meanwhile, those snake eyes, which were filled with evil demonic aura, were staring intently at the both of them. Lin Dong slowly took a step forward, while lightning crackled within his eyes. Soon after, a thunder suddenly resounded from within his body. Then, Thunder clouds began to converge within this dark space. In the next moment, countless thunderbolts crazily rained down. Instantly, this dark space became extremely dazzling and violent. Thunderbolt Ancestral Symbol When Ying Huan Huan saw the mysterious ripples being emitted from within Lin Dong's body, surprise involuntarily flashed across her pretty eyes as she softly cried out. I, I obtained it when I was at the chaotic demon sea. Lin Dong smiled. After which, he looked at the deepest part of the darkness and said, It seems like the great desolate tablet has already been overrun. In fact, the space within the tablet is now under the control of the true king. We can just break it. Ying Huan Huan clenched her hand. Immediately, endless chilling aura gathered before they transformed into a cold ice like zither. Then, her hands landed on it before she plucked the strings on her zither. The zither music sounded. Immediately, a monstrous blue icy ripple suddenly swept out from the zither. That ice ripple swept across the place, transforming into a huge ice phoenix in the process. Following which, a clear phoenix cry resounded through the darkness. Swoosh! The ice phoenix rushed forward. It was accompanied by a monstrous cold aura as it charged into the darkness, which was permeated by endless demonic aura. Finally, it exploded with a loud bang. Infinite Ice Seal An icy cold voice was emitted from Ying Huan Huan's mouth. Soon after, Lin Dong's pupils hardened when he saw that the overbearing Yu Mo Chi had actually froze. Following which, they turned into many black ice crumbs before they vanished with a bang. The darkness was disappearing at a frightening speed. The Lindong duo quickened their pace and chased after that darkness. 
This continued for a while before their footsteps began to slow. Then, their expressions gradually turned cold as they looked at the scene in front of them. Far in front of them was black barren land. Meanwhile, in the middle of that barren land, stood a black stone tablet. That stone tablet was the tablet spirit of the great desolate tablet, which Lin Dong had met before. However, Lin Dong's eyes merely paused on the stone tablet for a moment. After which, he slowly shifted his attention upwards. This was because he saw a black figure seated on top of the stone tablet. Tisk tisk, what a familiar scent. Seated on the stone tablet, a devil slowly lifted his head. His crimson eyes were filled with utmost evil and it looked as though there were endless brutality surging within them. His sharp hands grabbed that stone tablet, before he scratched it with his nails. Immediately, a couple of deep scars were left on the surface of the tablet. That devil stared at Lin Dong, before his eyes shrunk slightly. Devouring Ancestral Symbol? Thunderbolt Ancestral Symbol? Tisk tisk, you are indeed capable. To think that you managed to subdue two ancestral symbols. A true king who has only passed two reincarnation tribulations. Aren't you a little too arrogant? Ying Huan Huan chuckled. That devil turned towards Ying Huan Huan. In that instance, Lin Dong could sense that the demonic aura around the former's body had trembled violently. In fact, there seemed to be hatred and a deeply buried fear within its eyes. It's indeed you. Ice Master. That devil's sharp voice sounded, it seems like you have successfully reincarnated. However, from the looks of it, you have not regained your full strength. How dare you act so arrogantly in front of me? Tisk tisk. That devil roared towards the sky and said, it's just as well. I shall kill you before you regain your full strength. After that, no one will be able to stop my tribe. A gentle smile surfaced on Lin Dong's face. However, his smile was filled with icy cold intent. In the next moment, black light and lightning glow surged simultaneously in his eyes. Following which, vast and mighty ripples swept forth in all directions. Have you lost your mind after being sealed for so long? There is no telling who will be the one killed today. Chapter 1193 cooperating to slay the devil. Demonic aura was entwining the stone tablet. Above the tablet, when that devil heard Lin Dong's words, he immediately laughed towards the sky. Then, he suddenly stood up and spoke menacingly, ignorant fool. Back when I was at the top of the world, you weren't even born. Yet, you actually dare to act so haughtily in front of me. There is no shame in admitting that you are scared. Yet, you actually try to hide your fear by putting up a strong front. Lin Dong laughed softly while the chill in his eyes grew denser. I am afraid of you? What a joke! A black glint flashed across that devil's eyes, before he snorted. Then, he suddenly stomped his foot on the ground. Immediately, monstrous demonic aura directly transformed into a 10,000 feet large devil claw which penetrated the empty space and ruthlessly swiped at Lin Dong. Humph! Ying Huan Huan involuntarily let out a cold snort after she saw this attack. Immediately, the cold aura circling her body swept forth. However, just as she was about to make a move, Lin Dong took the lead and stepped forward. Then, he curled his palm before an endless number of thunderbolts were formed in his palm. Bang! Loud thunderous noises resounded through this dark space. Following which, a tens of thousands of feet large lightning dragon charged forward ferociously, before it clashed head-on with that devil claw. After which, countless lightning arcs shot out and vaporized the demonic aura permeating this place. Finally, a frightening energy assault wave spread. Lin Dong's and that devil's bodies all trembled. It turns out that they were pretty evenly matched. You are that little brat who came here back then, am I right? How unexpected. A boy, who was merely an ant back then, is actually quite capable now. That devil stared at Lin Dong with dark and cold eyes. Clearly, he had detected a familiar scent when he exchanged blows with Lin Dong previously. 
This ant has came back to finish you off. Lin Dong chuckled. Then, he turned towards Ying Huan Huan and said, I will set up a formation. Hence, I will need you to stall him for a while. Do not go overboard, withdraw if you cannot handle it. It is difficult to say just who is the one going overboard. Ying Huan Huan rolled her eyes at Lin Dong. After which, a frightening cold aura spread from within her body. Lin Dong had barely came into contact with that cold aura, before he felt a stinging sensation on his skin. Go! An icy blue glow rose on Ying Huan Huan's delicate figure. After which, her snow dress transformed into an ice armor. At this moment, an icy blue slim armor was appearing on her body. That ice armor covered her exquisite delicate figure, outlining her tempting curves. At this moment, Ying Huan Huan was emitting a heroic aura together with an iciness. In fact, her dashing demeanor did not lose out to Tang Xinlian, even when the latter was wearing armor. Ying Huan Huan clenched her hand after the ice armor appeared. Immediately, a long icy blue spear appeared. Then, she lowered her pretty eyes before a frightening aura spread. It seems like she could even match up to those peak experts, who have touched reincarnation. Be careful. Lin Dong was also startled by the aura that Ying Huan Huan had suddenly unleashed. Immediately, he involuntarily cried out. Quit being a nag. Ying Huan Huan curled her red lips. Although she said harsh words, a happy and gentle expression appeared within her beautiful eyes on her pretty face, which was covered by cold frost. Swoosh. However, even before Lin Dong could reply, Ying Huan Huan had already dashed forward. Immediately, monstrous cold aura swept out and prevented the evil demonic aura from approaching her. Meanwhile, accompanied by many afterimages, the ice spear in her hand enveloped that devil. Humph, Ice Master, I might still be a little wary of you if we were in the ancient era. However, aren't you being too arrogant now? That devil let out a cold snort when he saw Ying Huan Huan attack. Then, he clenched his large hand before his demonic aura agglomerated into a long black blade. Following which, he swung that blade furiously. Immediately, the empty space cracked before a blade glow filled with demonic aura flew furiously towards Ying Huan Huan, just like a demonic dragon. Clang! Ying Huan Huan's delicate figure flashed before the icy blue long spear in her hand penetrated the air and heavily struck against that blade filled with demonic aura. Following which, frightening cold aura surged and froze that blade glow directly. That cold aura spread. Ying Huan Huan's toes pressed against that frozen blade glow, before the latter shattered. After which, her body had appeared above that devil. Meanwhile, her hand seals were changing rapidly. Following which, cold aura gathered before they transformed into a 10,000 feet large ice lotus. Finally, that ice lotus heavily slammed down on that devil. Roar! Streams of frightening cold aura, which could even freeze demonic aura, came sweeping forth. Promptly, that devil roared towards the sky. Immediately, his body began to swell crazily. Meanwhile, his monstrous demonic aura raged across the entire space. Break! That devil roared out loud before he used his 10,000 feet large body to throw a punch forward. The monstrous demonic aura was like countless soaring demonic dragons. With a single punch, it blew the descending ice lotus apart. Ice fragments danced in the sky while Ying Huan Huan hovered in the air. Meanwhile, her pretty icy blue eyes contained an increasingly bright blue glint, while her long icy blue hair was also displaying an icy cold luster. That true king is quite powerful indeed. When Lin Dong saw the fight between the two of them, he involuntarily nodded. Although that true king had yet to recover his full strength, he was still able to thwart Ying Huan Huan, who possessed the ice ancestral symbol. Therefore, he was indeed quite frightening. Set up the formation quickly. The strength of that true king is rising rapidly. If you do not hurry, even Ying Huan Huan will no longer be able to stop him. Yan's voice swiftly sounded at this moment. Lin Dong nodded, before the expression in his eyes gradually became stern. 
he flipped his palm before an incomparably mysterious light formation surfaced. There were countless symbols entwined around each other within that light formation, and they were obscure and deep. It was the ancient universe formation within Lin Dong's body. After his strength surged, the might of the ancient universe formation now far exceed what it was before. Swoosh! That light formation rushed out from Lin Dong's hand and swelled with the wind. Within a short moment, it became tens of thousands of feet in size, covering the entire dark space in the process. The ancient universe formation floated high above in the sky. Meanwhile, it looked as though the space was contorting as it rotated. Lin Dong shut his eyes before mighty mental energy and Yuan power swept forth simultaneously. After which, they poured into the ancient universe formation. Then, those two powers began to slowly merge as that formation rotated. Meanwhile, an exceptionally frightening ripple was vaguely emitted. The frightening ripple emitted from that formation was also detected by that devil. Immediately, a cold glint flashed across his eyes. With a cold snort, he placed his devil claws together. Following which, an extremely concentrated beam of demonic light penetrated the space and rushed straight towards that formation. Bang! However, that demonic light had only just shot forth when a huge ice lotus suddenly appeared in front of it. Then, that ice lotus rotated before it blocked that demonic light. I am your opponent. Do not disturb him. A huge ice lotus slowly rose from a short distance away. Meanwhile, Ying Huan Huan's alluring figure was standing within. Her faint voice was filled with an icy chill. That devil stared at Ying Huan Huan, who was in his way, before a ferocious glint gathered in his eyes. Then, he suddenly released a low roar. Immediately, many strange seals appeared on his hands, before the monstrous demonic aura also began to gather crazily. Heaven Devil Burial Sky Seal A roar resounded before countless demonic aura gathered and rapidly transformed into a 10,000 feet large black devil seal. Meanwhile, countless sharp howls were emitted from that devil seal and it was a frightening sight to behold. Swoosh! After that devil seal was formed, it tore through the empty space before it charged towards Ying Huan Huan. A grave expression flashed across Ying Huan Huan's pretty face when she saw this attack. She gently waved her hand before cold aura agglomerated and transformed into an icy blue zither. Four divine beasts devil suppressing sound. Boom! The zither strings vibrated before vast and mighty ripples surged. After which, one could see a cold glow gathering around Ying Huan Huan. Within a couple of breaths time, that sonic wave transformed into the four divine beasts. A green dragon, white tiger, black tortoise, and vermilion bird were all made out of ice. Then, they roared towards the sky in unison before they whizzed forward and heavily collided against that huge devil seal. Bang! An earth-shaking ripple spread and many cracks were ripped on that originally distorted space. Meanwhile, both the cold aura and demonic aura suffered a heavy blow. The icy blue zither in front of Ying Huan Huan shattered along with that sound. Meanwhile, cracks began to appear on her ice armor. At the same time, that monstrous devil in the distance was sent flying by over 10,000 feet. Meanwhile, the demonic aura surrounding him had also diminished. Clearly, both parties were injured in this head-on collision. However, the missing demonic aura around that devil was quickly replenished at a frightening rate. Clearly, this was because the seal placed on him was gradually weakening. In fact, once that seal disappears, he would return to his peak condition. Haha, <laughs> the both of you are too slow. I am becoming more and more powerful. What can you guys do to me? That devil had naturally detected his advantage. Immediately, his wild laughter was just like thunder as it resounded through this dark space. It is too early for you to be celebrating. A cold chuckle was suddenly transmitted from the sky. After which, one saw Lin Dong standing in the sky. Meanwhile, his ancient universe formation had begun to rotate. Soon after, he twirled his hands before black light swirled around one hand, while lightning glow crackled on the other. Faintly, two ancient symbols were visible. 
with two ancestral symbols as the eye of the formation, I refuse to believe that I cannot finish you off. Two ancient symbols suddenly shot out from Lin Dong's hands. After which, they flew directly into the ancient universe formation, which was hovering in the sky. Immediately, black light and lightning glow shone down from the ancient universe formation in all directions. Ancient universe formation, slay the devil. Lin Dong's hand seals changed rapidly before a low cry was suddenly emitted from his mouth. Buzz. After his cry, the ancient universe formation began to rotate violently. Immediately, countless rays of light crisscrossed before they directly sealed that devil. Following which, a frightening strength was emitted and it swiftly purified the demonic aura around that devil. Sizzle sizzle. Dense white fog spread from within that devil's body. The latter was startled upon seeing this. He hurriedly circulated his demonic aura and ruthlessly attacked the light curtain prison, which was formed by those rays of light. Bang! However, despite using his full strength, he was only able to create a few ripples on that light curtain and it showed no signs of collapsing. Do you really think that you can destroy me with this? In your dreams. At this moment, a ferocious glint flickered within that devil's eyes. Suddenly, his humongous body emitted waves of low and deep explosive noises, before his already massive body swelled even further. Meanwhile, waves of extremely terrifying ripples were swiftly formed. Tisk tisk, little fellow. You came a little too late. Right now, the great desolate tablet seal has hardly any impact on me. Once I escape and regain my full strength, all of you shall be squashed like ants. A loud arrogant laughter sounded. The body of that devil swelled to its limit, and even with two great ancestral symbols, the ancient universe formation was unable to completely suppress him. Moreover, once he broke free from the formation's restrain, he would be able to escape from the great desolate tablet. At that time, the great desolate tablet's seal would become completely useless. Lin Dong, we must not allow him to escape from the great desolate tablet. Yan's somewhat anxious voice sounded. Lin Dong clenched his teeth, before he pushed the ancient universe formation to its limit. No way, he is recovering far too quickly. Even two ancestral symbols cannot suppress him. Well, then add another one. Yan swiftly replied. Add another one. Lin Dong was startled. However, he quickly came to a comprehension. Then, he hurriedly cried out, Huan Huan, lend me your ice ancestral symbol. Ying Huan Huan nodded immediately upon hearing Lin Dong's cry. She beckoned with her hand, before an ancient icy cold symbol shot out from her hand without hesitation. Finally, it headed straight towards Lin Dong. The ice ancestral symbol hovered in front of Lin Dong. He involuntarily took a glance at this ancestral symbol, which could freeze the entire world. After which, his eyes turned towards that devil, which had swelled to its limit, before a grin surfaced on the corner of his lips. Trying to escape? I'm afraid that it isn't going to be so easy. Chapter 1194, Disaster Lin Dong did not hesitate once he received the ice ancestral symbol. With a flick of his finger, the ancestral symbol turned into a flash of cold light that was directly cast into the enormous ancient universe formation in the sky. Buzz! When the ice ancestral symbol was cast into the formation, rays of light immediately exploded from the ancient universe formation as its power levels rapidly multiplied. Ah! With the aid of the third ancestral symbol, the body of the devil figure which had swelled to its limits was forcibly compressed. Devil Chi swiftly faded as rays of light shined on its body, while miserable shrieks rang out without end. It is not so easy to destroy this king. At this moment, that devil figure also felt the threat of death and it immediately howled in anger. Devil Chi crazily surged, forcibly pushing away those countless rays of light. Lin Dong's expression was cold. His hand seals suddenly changed as a low voice echoed, Extreme Trinity Devil Extermination. Swish. Three rays of light abruptly shot forth from within the ancient universe formation. These three light rays were black, 
silver and blue. They seemed tiny, but the ancestral symbol power contained within them was as pure as it could be. These three rays of light shot down towards the devil figure from three different directions. Threads of light extended from them, forming an enormous triangle that sealed the devil figure. Three ancient symbols appeared at the three corners of this light formation as a mighty and ancient power spread outwards. Buzz. Once the triangle light formation was formed, endless black light, lightning, and an icy aura seemed to fill the sky as they surged forth. The devil chi that blotted the sky was swiftly beaten back, while the glowing triangle shrunk at an astonishing speed. As the light triangle shrunk, the devil figure that was sealed within it also started to be rapidly compressed. Crazed roars of rage continued to emerge. Lin Dong's eyes were cold. His gaze was firmly fixed on the swiftly shrinking light formation. In a dozen breaths, the originally 10,000 feet tall devil figure was now merely a foot tall. Devil Extermination At this instant, an ominous glint abruptly flashed in Lin Dong's eyes. The triangle light formation suddenly exploded as the torrential devil chi frantically disappeared. A mournful cry of despair quickly followed suit. Bang! An indescribable shock wave unfurled in the air. The dark domain completely crumbled, while the devil chi within vanished into nothingness at this moment. Ugh! Lin Dong was also hit by the aftershocks. He immediately felt a sweetness in his throat and he spit out a mouthful of fresh blood as his figure shot backwards. Soon after, he felt a soft force on his back as an ice-cold hand pressed against his back and stopped him. Lin Dong wiped the blood at the corner of his mouth as he tilted his head back to gaze at beautiful face that was mere inches away. Both of them seemed to be able to clearly feel the other's breaths whilst they looked into each other's eyes. A faint flush swiftly rose on that pretty face that was as fair as snow. Are you all right? Ying Huan Huan softly said. Lin Dong nodded, before casting his gaze into the distance. The devil chi within the domain had already completely vanished. Pillars of light shot into the dark domain, expelling the darkness. Is that fellow dead? Ying Huan Huan's beautiful eyes scanned the area. Unable to find the devil figure. She could not help but ask. It is still not completely dead. These Yumo are indeed extremely difficult to deal with. Lin Dong shook his head. Soon after, he beckoned with his hand and a light beam shot out from within the ancient universe formation and landed in his hand. It was a palm-sized triangle crystal. However, there was Devil Chi swirling within it. The Devil Chi seemingly transformed into a black bead the size of a longan. What is this? Upon seeing this, Ying Huan Huan asked in surprise. Something good. Lin Dong laughed. This bead was the product of compressing the true king to the limit. The true king's mind had already been erased, and what was left was a power that was berserk to the extreme. Although such energy could not be absorbed, if one encountered a tough foe in future, this energy could be released. Even Lin Dong felt a little fearful of its power. With a flip of his land, Lin Dong kept the bead sealed within the triangle crystal. Subsequently, he focused and the ancient universe formation in the sky slowly faded, before transforming into a flash of light that shot into his body. When the light formation faded, three specks of light rapidly descended and transformed into three ancient ancestral symbols. Um, your ice ancestral symbol. Lin Dong kept the devouring ancestral symbol and the thunderbolt ancestral symbol into his body, before handing over the ice ancestral symbol to Ying Huan Huan. He took an additional look at the ice ancestral symbol with some curiosity. Amongst the eight great ancestral symbols, besides the two ancestral symbols in his body, he had only seen the flame ancestral symbol and the ice ancestral symbol. When Ying Huan Huan saw Lin Dong's curious gaze, her jade-like hand gently tucked her beautiful ice-blue hair behind her ear as she faintly smiled and said, If you like, I can give it to you. You are very generous hey, do you really think that this is some cheap cabbage? Upon hearing this, Lin Dong could not help but chuckle as he shook his head. To be capable of casually giving away something like the ancestral symbol, she was likely the only one in this world. However, he naturally could not accept a gift like this. 
Subsequently, he handed over the ice ancestral symbol and said, Only you can bring out the full potential of this ice ancestral symbol. Even if you give it to me, whether or not I'll be able to subdue it will be another issue. Moreover, it is too precious and I cannot accept it. Ying Huan Huan was silent. When she saw that Lin Dong had no intentions of keeping it, she reached out to receive it. Her fingertip gently touched it and the ice ancestral symbol disappeared into her hand. The devil chi has already faded, the great desolate tablet should recover right. Lin Dong's turned his gaze downwards. The originally bare land there was now decorated by lush green vegetation, while faint life energy started to spread in this domain. At the center of the land, the evil blackness on the great desolate tablet also started to recede at a shocking speed. In its place, was an ancient aura. Since you've already awoken, why are you still pretending to be asleep? Great desolate tablet, you are not honest at all. Ying Huan Huan indifferently glanced at the recovered great desolate tablet and suddenly said. He he, as expected of the Ice Master's reincarnation, as Ying Huan Huan's words faded, an old laughter emerged from the great desolate tablet. It sounded a little embarrassed. Ying Huan Huan's previous identity was even more senior than this great desolate tablet. Hence, even an ancient and monstrous existence like itself was unable to play its senior card. Light gathered on the great desolate tablet and an old figure slowly appeared. This elder had a head full of white hair and a gentle smile filled his face. He smiled at Lin Dong and said, Many thanks little friend. Elder is too courteous. I naturally have to fulfill the promise I made. Moreover, I have already received Elder's reward back then. Lin Dong smiled as he replied. The reward he spoke of was naturally the Great Desolation Scripture. Although he rarely used the Great Desolation Scripture in the past three years, it had helped Lin Dong get through dangerous situations time and time again. Thus, he was rather thankful towards this Great Desolate Tablet. He <laughs> he. Is the old fellow within your body not coming out to meet an old friend? When I sensed it back then, it was in a dire state. However, I believe that it has recovered substantially. The great desolate tablet chuckled as he spoke. As his words faded, a gentle white light shot out from within Lin Dong's body. Yan appeared and gazed at the great desolate tablet as a smile surfaced on his face, You're really tenacious huh old fellow? Even this was unable to kill you. Haha, <laughs> since even you have yet to die, how can I possibly dare to leave first? Lin Dong chuckled as he heard the conversation between the two. Although they seemed to be at odds with each other, he could sense the deep feelings between them. These two were the two most powerful great divine objects created by the symbol ancestor, and were naturally on extremely good terms. Since you have already recovered, it is pointless to stay here. What are your plans? Why not leave with one of them? While Yan was chatting with the Great Desolate Tablet, his eyes flashed as he suddenly asked. The Great Desolate Tablet and Yan clearly had a great understanding of each other. After seeing the flash in the latter's eyes, he was first a little stunned, before he quickly smiled and said, In your opinion, which choice will be better? Yan laughed dryly but did not reply. Lin Dong felt a little awkward. He naturally understood what Yan wanted to say. This fellow wanted him to accept the great desolate tablet. However, finishing off that true king from before was not his merit alone. Moreover, he was not willing to take advantage of Ying Huan Huan. Of course, he could faintly sense the deeper underlying intention. However, it was too far away and he did not want to think about it. For a time, the atmosphere was a little silent and strange. After all, with Ying Huan Huan here, Yan did not dare to be too obvious. In their silence, Ying Huan Huan looked at Yan with a smile that did not seem to be a smile on her face. Upon seeing this, Yan could only release a hollow laugh. You should follow him. Having both of your support will be good. Ying Huan Huan turned her gaze towards the great desolate tablet as she faintly smiled and declared. He he, since the ice master says so, this old one can only listen. Young brother Lin Dong, 
are you willing to allow this old one to follow you? The great desolate tablet smiled and asked. Lin Dong did not reply. He tilted his head and stared at Ying Huan Huan. The latter used her clear ice blue eyes to meet his gaze. He did not know what was contained in the depths of those beautiful eyes. This lasted for a moment, before Lin Dong softly sighed in his heart. Soon after, he nodded at the great desolate tablet. Ha <laughs> ha! Yan chuckled, but did not linger in this strange atmosphere. His figure moved and transformed into a flash of light that tunneled into Lin Dong's body, while the great desolate tablet also hastily returned to the tablet. Let's go. After the long silence, Lin Dong shook his head and turned around. With a wave of his sleeve, the space in front of him split open. Just as he was about to leave, he felt a tug at the corner of his clothes. Slightly stunned, he immediately turned his head. Ying Huan Huan stared at him as her teeth bit into her red lips, while a strange look was present in her beautiful eyes. While you were away for three years, I would go to the Great Yan Empire to visit your parents every year. Lin Dong forced a smile. He already knew about this matter from Lu Yan. There was this one time that I met someone else. She belongs to Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace, and she seems to be called. Ling Kings are right. Lin Dong looked at Ying Huan Huan's icy and penetrating eyes. For a time, cold sweat appeared on his forehead. This was a disaster. Chapter 1195, Error in Judgment Lin Dong stood before the spatial crack. He did not know what kind of expression he was showing on his face, but there was a little cold sweat on his forehead. Although he had a sense of foreboding after finding out from Lu Yan that Ying Huan Han and Ling King Zhu had unexpectedly visited his parents, he never imagined that the two of them had actually met. How should he explain? While Lin Dong was having a mini breakdown, the one who had been staring at him with a pair beautiful yet frosty and piercing eyes, Ying Huan Huan, faintly smiled as she gave him a meaningful look before leaping past him. Subsequently, her slender figure disappeared into the spatial crack. Upon seeing this, Lin Dong helplessly shook his head before following. Outside the great desolate tablet, two figures shot out from the tablet and appeared in the sky. Currently, layers of Yuan power light spread over its exterior. Ying Suanzi, Little Martin, First Elder Zhu Li and the others were solemnly waiting with grave expressions. Anxiety surfaced in their eyes when they saw the two figures exit. Only after clearly identifying the two figures did they finally sigh in relief. What is the situation? Ying Suanzi could not resist asking. After all, he was aware of just how terrifying the Yumo suppressed within the Great Desolate Table was. If it managed to escape, it would bring about a calamity onto Dao sect. We have finished it off. Lin Dong smiled. Ying Suanzi finally heaved a sigh of relief after hearing this. Soon after, the various defenses in the sky also disappeared. Lin Dong turned his head. He looked at the ancient Great Desolate Tablet below and beckoned with his hand. Many rays of light shot out from within the great desolate tablet. After which, the stone table rapidly shrunk. Finally, it became as big as a palm and landed into Lin Dong's hand. He fiddled with the stone tablet in his hand. After having resolved the problem of the Yumo, Lin Dong could vaguely detect the mighty aura emanating from within the great desolate tablet. The great desolate tablet was ranked a high third on the ancient divine object rankings. The symbol ancestor had created it back then with the purpose of suppressing and killing Yumo. Countless Yumo kings had died under the stone tablet during that ancient era. If it was not because the great desolate tablet was subsequently badly damaged, it was likely that the true king, whose strength had reached the level of two reincarnation tribulations, would have difficulty creating such a dire situation for the tablet. Now that the great desolate tablet was in Lin Dong's hands, it was undoubtedly akin to adding wings to a ferocious a tiger. Lin Dong could be considered a true devil slayer. He possessed many treasures that were able to suppress the Yumo. Chen Zhen smacked his lips regretfully after seeing that the great desolate tablet had been kept by Lin Dong. Their desolate hall was most proud of their great desolate scripture. 
Although it was extremely rare for someone to have the qualifications to practice this martial art, it could still be considered the main treasure of the hall. Now that it had been taken away, the desolate hall would lose its frightening reputation. Lin Dong involuntarily smiled when he saw this expression. He clenched his hand and mental energy gathered within. It directly transformed into a palm-sized stone tablet in his hand. After which, this stone tablet was tossed to Chen Zhen. Marshal Uncle Chen Zhen, this is the cultivation method for the great desolate scripture. However, this martial art is far too deep and profound. Unless one possesses the necessary talent, not only will one be incapable of learning it, but attempting to do so will also bring harm to the individual. Therefore, those who wish to try and comprehend it must undergo various selections. Lin Dong said. If someone with overwhelming talent was to comprehend this martial art in future, it might end up creating an expert of great importance to Dao sect. Naturally, Lin Dong could not be selfish. Without Dao sect, it was likely that he would have also been unable to obtain the great desolate scripture. Chen Zhen hastily received the stone tablet as Joy involuntarily surged on his elderly face. He hurriedly nodded and said, You can be rest assured that there will definitely be someone amongst the younger generation of the desolate hall who will be able to comprehend it in future. Lin Dong smiled. He looked at the empty ground and heaved a big sigh of relief in his heart. He had finally resolved the problem of the great desolate tablet. In this way, there was only one problem left. You and Gate, since you wish to invade Dao sect, I shall wait for you here. Lin Dong lifted his head. His eyes gradually became cold as he looked towards the southwest direction. Overflowing murderous desire rose within his eyes. In the next two days, Lin Dong personally stood guard in Dao sect. With a strong pillar like him, the atmosphere of the entire Dao sect was completely transformed. If Dao sect was described as being filled with anxiety in the past, they were now filled with readiness to fight. Even if Yuan Gate was to launch a full invasion, it was unlikely that they would feel no fear. The source of this courage was the skinny figure who stood atop a mountain each day. That figure was not tall and bulky, but was akin to a source of faith. Every disciple within Dao sect believed that as long as the figure remained standing, their Dao sect would shine forever like the sun in the sky. During the two days, all the disciples would turn their eyes towards the tallest peak in Dao sect after completing their daily training. Their eyes were filled with fervor and respect. The eyes of some young ladies would even contain admiration and bashfulness. After all, that figure, which had a demeanor that even Ying Suanzi could not match, did indeed possess substantial destructive force on some ignorant young ladies. Of course, none of them dwelled too deeply on such thoughts. This was because there would be an equally outstanding figure beside Lin Dong every day. She possessed a pretty face and ice blue long hair which glittered beautifully under the setting sun. Although there was a frightening chillness constantly present around her, everyone could sense that her eyes would become extremely gentle when they shifted towards the young man. It was to the extent that it could melt even a metal heart. Lin Dong likewise used these two days to completely refine and control the great desolate tablet. This proceeded extremely smoothly. After all, the great desolate tablet was without an owner and Lin Dong had gained its acceptance. Hence, this refinement process did not encounter any hindrance. Lin Dong could feel just how powerful the great desolate tablet was after having refined it. It was different from the ancestral stone, which was a divine object that gently purified demonic qi. The great desolate tablet was made with the purpose of suppressing and killing Yumo. Hence, it possessed an incomparable offensive power. Such power caused even Lin Dong to praise in his heart. With the great desolate tablet in his hands, he would undoubtedly possess another powerful technique when dealing with Yumo in future. Two days quietly passed by while Lin Dong refined the great desolate tablet. However, Lin Dong felt a little uncertain when the anticipated scene of Yuan Gate launching a huge invasion did not occur. The powerful army that was solemnly waiting did not discover any traces of Yuan Gate. Of course, despite such uncertainty, the entire Dao sect retained the necessary caution. 
The only difference was that Lin Dong was gradually increasing the size of the territory being searched by Dao sect and began to gather various information about the eastern Xian region. In the past, Dao sect seldom did such a thing. This was because they had been forced by Yuan Gate to the point of only being able to protect the sect. They did not possess the additional strength to bother about other matters. Another two days once again passed by amidst this strange silence. Lin Dong stood with his hands behind his back on the mountain. His eyes leaped over the bustling scene in Dao sect and peered into the distance. The sky was blue, while a flock of birds flew past. It appeared extremely leisurely. Is there still no activity? Lin Dong frowned and muttered. Based on the information we have received, no traces of Yuan Gate have been found within a thousand mile radius of Dao sect. Behind him, Ying Huan Huan replied after hearing his mutter. Yuan Gate has a deep-seated hatred for our Dao sect. Amongst the super sects in the eastern Xian region, Dao sect is the one that they wish to eliminate the most. Normally speaking, they should be unable to endure the fact that our Dao sect is still standing. Yet, why is it that they have become quiet during this period of time? Lin Dong softly said. Ying Huan Huan shook her head and asked, Has there been any activity in the Great Yan Empire? Nothing. I have set up a spatial imprint in the Great Yan Empire. I should be able to detect any activity and hurry over immediately. Lin Dong shook his head. His parents were in the Great Yan Empire. Hence, the defense there must naturally be perfect. Ying Huan Huan also frowned. This strange peacefulness had instead caused one to feel uneasy. Both of them stood on the mountain. It was a long time later before they shook their heads. They were about to leave when Lin Dong suddenly turned his head. A figure was swiftly rushing towards them from the direction of Dao sect. It soon appeared in their sights. Senior brother Lin Dong, little senior sister Huan Huan. That figure rapidly approached and a somewhat anxious exclamation entered their ears. An Ran? What is it? Lin Dong looked at the young lady, who had anxiously hurried over, before he asked in a slightly startled manner. Bad news. An Ran's small face was a little flushed as she urgently spoke. Sect Master has asked me to inform the both of you that Yuan Gate has finally made a move. Oh. Lin Dong was slightly startled. He hurriedly said, Yuan Gate has attacked. No An Ran panted a couple of times. Her small face slightly altered as she said, Yuan Gate did not attack our Dao sect, but instead went to attack Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace. Based on the information we have obtained, Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace has suffered a series of continuous defeats. They are about to lose their sect. Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace Lin Dong and Ying Huan Huan were startled upon hearing this. The former's expression suddenly changed drastically. Senior brother Lin Dong, sect master has sent me to ask you what should we do? Do we go and help Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace or do we guard Dao sect? An Ran asked. Lin Dong clenched his fists tightly as his eyes flashed anxiously. If they were to head to Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace, they would definitely end up splitting their forces. What would they do if they fell for Yuan Gate's trick to divert their forces away and Yuan Gate ended up taking the opportunity to attack Dao sect? However, if they did not go, Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace would definitely be destroyed. At that time, Ling Qingzhu would likely be unable to escape this calamity. Lin Dong was clearly unable to sit idly and do nothing when he thought about the prideful lady, whom he could not forget. Amongst the super sects in the eastern Xian region, only our Dao sect and Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace are left. Our enemy is Yuan Gate. Therefore, we can be said to each make up half of an alliance. It would not benefit our Dao sect if they were destroyed. A faint voice was transmitted from behind as Lin Dong's eyes flashed. But... Lin Dong turned his head and looked at Ying Huan Huan's pretty face. The latter glanced at him before immediately turning her head away and said, I can place a spatial imprint in Dao sect. We can immediately tear open space and hurry back if any unexpected changes occur. There should be enough time to do so. 
Lin Dong briefly hesitated. However, he was not an indecisive person. He quickly weighed the situation and nodded. An Ran, inform sect master that we will leave and reinforce Nine Heavens Supreme Purity Palace. Understood. An Ran hurriedly replied, before she swiftly turned around and left. Soon after, an urgent bell resounded across the entire Dao sect. Lin Dong looked at Dao sect, which had fallen into an uproar. He let out a deep breath and looked at Ying Huan Huan. After a little hesitation, he said, Why don't you remain behind and guard Dao sect? Ying Huan Huan's pretty eyes looked at him. Her eyes caused Lin Dong to laugh dryly in an uneasy manner. Soon after, she finally extended her icy hand and gently grabbed Lin Dong's arm. An unusually pretty smile was suddenly revealed on her frosty and pretty face. However, before Lin Dong could become intoxicated by this brilliant smile, her drawn-out voice reached his ears, causing his head to be immediately covered in perspiration. I also wish to go. Additionally, I want to meet that girl called Ling Qingzu. Back then, I only saw her from afar and did not manage to get a clear look. 